Hi, I'm Max Eberly, and welcome to Hard Times Billiards in Bellflower, California. And today I'm going to show you how to hold a cue stick. And of course, you're going to need a cue ball, an object ball, a cue stick. So, first thing is the position of your hand. Once you're down in this position and the tip is there, try to get your, your right arm perpendicular to the ground, and that's a good guideline for actually where to grip the cue. You can be a little bit in like that, but you don't want to be way up here. That, see how that's just too far up? And then if you're back here and the angle of your arm is too far back, then you want to bring your, your hand back here. So I want basically a, a vertical forearm position. So that's, that's how I'm going to figure out where to put my hand. Okay, it's going to be different for everybody based on your height and the length of your arms. So you really can't necessarily just follow what your favorite player does or watching other players. You have to find out how your body is positioned based, based on just getting down and then put your, put your forearm so it's straight up and down. So it's going to look something like this. From that side, it'll look like, like this. So you're not squeezing it like that. It's just kind of resting in your fingers and your thumb is hanging down here. You don't want to put your thumb up here and you don't want to grip the cue like that too lightly. So hold on to it, kind of like you're doing a pull up. Keep it relatively loose and resist the urge to squeeze too tight on your follow through. So just keep it nice and loose and let your fingers have some play as you pull back. So you don't want to squeeze it on, on the way back either. Let, your, let the fingers kind of roll. So what you don't want to do is, you don't want to put your thumb up on top of the cue and you don't want to hold it too loose like that. So not too tight, you don't want to grip it too tight because then you won't be able to give a very nice throwing motion. So not too tight, not too loose. And as you pull back, let the cue have a little play as you go back. So let it be relaxed without being too relaxed and don't let it be too tight. It's probably the best way to explain that. So here, I'll just show you. It's good to watch. I'm Max Eberly, and that's how to hold a cue.